Tween Tweening is a feature that helps us to make animation process easier and faster. It is used for some specific kind of animations by calculating and generating some frames for you between an initial and a final point. Some important points about the tween. There should be at least one object in the scene to use a tween. One kind of tween can be applied for every object. If an object is part of a tween, then that object cannot be edited as a vector path. There are many kinds of tween in 2P 2D. Motion, rotation, scale, shear, opacity and coloring. Let us learn about these tweens one by one. Motion tween. This tween helps to move an object. The motion tween automatically creates intermediate frames for you. To use motion tween, follow the given steps. Step 1. Draw any object on the workspace area. Here we have drawn a rectangle. Step 2. Click on Tween option. Step 3. Choose Motion Tween. Step 4. Click on plus button and type a name for the tween then select the object. Step 5. Click on Set Path Properties. Step 6. Click at different points to set the path for the animation. As you click, Tupi will automatically create path for you. Step 7. Click on Save button at the bottom of the Position Tween Properties window and close the file. Step 8. Click on Play button to play the animation in the Player window. Rotation Tween. This tween helps to rotate an object clockwise and anti-clockwise. The rotation tween automatically rotates the object as per the specification given. To use rotation tween, follow the given steps. Step 1. Open a new project and insert an image from the library to the workspace. Step 2. Click on tween option. Step 3. Choose rotation tween. Step 4. Type a name for the animation and click on plus button. Step 5. Now click on the object and then click on the set path properties. Step 6. Set the type of rotation as a continuous or partial. Set the direction of rotation and starting and ending degrees of rotation. Step 7. Set the loop if you want to rotate the object in a loop and speed of rotation. Step 8. Save the animation and play the animation by clicking on the play button in the player window. Scale tween. This tween helps to give zooming effect to an object. Step 1. Click on tween option and choose scale tween. Step 2. Enter a name for the animation and click on the plus button. Step 3. Open a new project and draw a shape using the pencil tool. Step 4. Now click on the object and then click on Set Path Properties. Step 5. Now set the properties as Starting Frame and Ending Frame. Set Scaling Type as Width and Height, Scaling Factors and Iterations. Step 6. Click on the loop if you want to run continuously. Step 7. Click on the Save button to save the animation. Step 8. Play the animation by clicking on play button in the player window. Shear tween. This tween changes the object horizontal and vertical shear. To apply shear tween, follow the given steps. Step 1. Draw a line using the pencil tool. Step 2. Click on tween option and choose shear tween. Step 3. Enter a name for the animation and click on the plus button. Step 4. Now click on the object and then click on Set Properties. Step 5. Now set the properties as Starting Frame and Ending Frame. Set Shear in Type as Width and Height or both, Iterations and Loop. Step 6. Click on the Save button to save the animation. Step 7. Play the animation by clicking on Play button. Opacity Tween this tween controls the opacity level of the object from starting to ending at two different points. 
we just need to define the opacity at the beginning and end points and in between frames are automatically created by software step 1 draw a rectangle using a brush tool step 2 click on tween option and choose opacity tween step 3 enter a name for the animation and click on the plus button Step 4 click on the object and then click on set path properties. Step 5 now set the properties as starting frame and ending frame. Set initial and ending opacity level and set iterations loop. Step 6 click on the save button to save the animation. Step 7 play the animation by clicking on the play button. Coloring tween This tween effect changes the color from the beginning frame to the ending frame. You can define the color for the first frame and ending frame and the intermediate frames are automatically created as per the specification provided. Step 1. Draw a circle using the brush tool. Step 2. Click on tween option and choose coloring tween. Step 3. Enter a name for the animation and click on plus button. Step 4. Click on the object and then click on set properties. Step 5. Now set the properties as starting frame and ending frame. Choose filling, starting color and ending color. Set iterations loop. Step 6. Click on save option to save the animation. Step 7. Play the animation by clicking on the play button.